Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a common issue that many developers encounter when working with Spring and JSON. Our viewer is facing an unresolved forward reference exception while trying to deserialize a JSON object for a material entity. Let's dive into the details of this problem and explore potential solutions together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're gonna to be going through your question, going through some of the answers, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. In this video, we will address the issue of unresolved forward references when deserializing JSON in a Spring application using Jackson. The error occurs when you try to send a JSON object that references another object by its ID. In our case, the material object references the agent's object using its ID. To resolve this, we use the at JSON identity info annotation. This allows Jackson to handle object references correctly by using the ID instead of the entire object. However, if you still encounter unresolved forward references, ensure that your agent's class is also properly annotated and that the JSON structure matches the expected format. Finally, if the problem persists, consider implementing a custom object ID resolver to manage the references more effectively. This can provide a more robust solution for complex object graphs. Let's now look at a user suggested answer. If you're facing a Jackson exception due to a cyclical object graph in your one-to-many relationship, there's a solution. You can use the JSOC Serializer plugin for Jackson. This plugin can handle both serialization and deserialization of cyclical object graphs since Jackson version 2.5.1. Here's a quick code example. Use the at JSON identity info annotation with the JSON generator class in your person class. Let's now look at another user suggested answer. When deserializing JSON with Spring and Jackson, you might encounter unresolved forward references. This happens when you have two domains, material and agents. Jackson tries to deserialize material, which calls the getAgents method, returning an agents object. Then, when it calls getMaterials from agents, it returns a set of material. The issue arises because Jackson attempts to deserialize each material in that set again, leading to a circular reference problem. For more details on this issue, you can check a similar question on Stack Overflow, which discusses circular references in JSON and Java. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To resolve the Jackson exception related to unresolved forward references, you can modify your controller method. 
This allows you to have full control over the JSON mapping process. In the modified method, you read the request body, deserialize it into a bean object, and save it using your service. Finally, you create a URI for the newly saved bean and return it in the response, ensuring proper handling of the created resource. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your question I hope, and you found that resolution. Guys, if this helped, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, have a good one.